Hello everyone, my name is Coxic. I stream on Twitch, do designs and art, and also have a small story with badges, panels and overlays. In this video, we will analyze cases when a streamer needs Twitch delay. What are the pros and cons of delay? And of course, how to enable it? While most people like to get rid of the luck they are experiencing on Twitch, there are times when you meet won't want to hide your position in the game or set up something special for your chat. This guide will cover both, how you can reduce your delay and add one so that your streaming needs will be covered. How to check and reduce your stream delay on Twitch? Unfortunately, there is no way for you to determine exactly what your stream's delay will be. There are many factors that play into the answer, such as your computer speed, your internet provider, and the location of your viewers. Log into your Twitch account and select your avatar in the upper right hand corner. Select Creator's dashboard from the drop down menu. Click the settings tab Stream. Look for latency mode under Major Content and make sure that you have selected low latency. When to use low latency Twitch? The primary purpose most streamers set up a Twitch delay is to avoid being stream sniped. A negative of broadcasting live publicly is it allows other gamers to know exactly where you are. Though some teams and guilds enjoy the added challenge, many other creator rules prohibiting streamers to broadcast while they are in groups unless there is a stream delay. Unfortunately, there isn't a way to stream with no delay. As computers and internet speeds advance, latency will decrease. You can stream in Discord for a faster latency, then you would get through traditional streaming platforms. While you can't publicly stream, you can host smaller private streams that only show your gameplay. This is a good way to get fast feedback. Discord Nitro also allows you to stream at a higher resolution. Depending on where you are in the world, there is generally a 5-30 second delay from your current action to when your viewer will see it. To increase that time on the Twitch platform, you must have a partnership status, you can also set it up through your broadcasting software. To create a delay in OBS, follow those steps. From the file menu, select the settings option, click Advanced on the left side of the pop-up menu. Locate the stream delay section of the screen. Click the enable button and adjust to the amount of time you want to pass before your viewers see your broadcast. Click the apply button at the bottom of the page. The number one reason to use stream delay is to avoid stream sniping. The act of a viewer or a group of viewers using the information you are streaming to their gaming advantage. Examples of this include Stalking a player in a battle royale game using the broadcast to make it easier to eliminate them. This generally only happens to well-known streamers as they are easier to recognize. Due to these factors, and especially in less popular games, many players may not want to group up when someone is live streaming. Guilds may create rules and disallow it without the delay. Thank you for watching, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment. On my channel you can find more videos on streaming topics and a link to my small design store for streamers in the description below. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!